This is your Evergreen Minute. I'm Staff Sergeant Peter Christian. First Corps hosted the Total Force Summit this week at Joint Base Lewis McChord. The summit is a gathering of minds from U.S. active, reserve, and guard components, as well as a few of our civilian and international counterparts. It aims to hammer out how to move forward on an ever-changing global battlefield. The Washington National Guard has had to rethink how it accomplishes its missions with a tightening fiscal policy and how to move forward on missions integration with other components such as active duty, reserves, and allied forces. That's why the Adjutant General of the Washington National Guard is participating in the Total Force Summit at Joint Base lewis McCord. I'm up for whatever you want to do. We're, we're happy to coordinate with the Corps. I'm sure we're already lashed up through the three-shot, uh, you know, explaining when we're going on our SME events. The stressors from rewriting the National Warfighting Plan due to military downsizing and large-scale force restructuring have certainly been felt by all levels of the Washington National Guard. The National Guard Bureau was on site to give an overview of how the National Guard structure works and how it can be applied to the warfighting needs of today. Providing governors and state action generals the capacity and capability to respond to homeland emergencies. National Guard leaders from several states were present and were able to ask and answer questions about what they could provide and how they have dealt with recent roadblocks successfully. From McCord Field, Joint Base Lewis McCord, Washington, I'm Staff Sergeant Peter Christian, Washington National Guard.